Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on notifications, comment something random, share the video, go to the description, follow all our social media. We have Roblox merch. You could buy some if you so want. I know this is not like very much Christmassy, but I thought I might as well talk about Tales of Tornario because I have not talked about it for a really long time. Tales of Tornario direct premiering on December 29th. Catch us at 4 p.m. EST, which is my time EST, so 4 p.m. my time. They showed showcase a few things. This, which I guess is just more like fog and then rain, some of the weather. Oh, look around the bird. And then PC, that's a dev. Um, I don't know if I could really leak it, but um, YouTubers are getting something. That's a VFX, um, I guess, without my PC dying. So here's a move animation without Tenarians. There's another Tenario. Seems like he gets upset every time he hits himself with his tail when he bonks himself in the head. These, I think these need a rework. Oh, I didn't see that one. That's the attack, that's how it looks like. Well, three, this is nothing, trust me, bro. And notebook, I guess that's like, well, that's Tenario Pideon. So let me, I don't know. Maybe it might be like a mastery thing. Um, these are important dialogues, manager, added custom interaction data for trainer battles and uh, auto hunting currently being messed around with so to see if it would be implemented and how trainer shines npc training extended players some uh summaries trainer classes some of these uh, stuff are really long um, Tamer levels are a system to reward players for playing the game both normally and through special means. As of release, these levels won't have any super special mechanics besides being used to flex and get rare and exclusive items, terrarians, and customizations. So you could customize terrarian, that's nice. Normal gameplay. This. I'm not getting copyrighted just in case if it is copyrighted music. I'm not gonna test that. So capture that's what I guess to capture it. This is some random light star shining. That's one of those running moon. More of these. I, okay, I'm not gonna read it because I will stay here for the whole entire day for that, and we can't do that right now. So this is one of the third evolution for the snakes. So it's gonna be like a dragon probably. Maybe like something like Charizard, I was thinking. Maybe it's just flying and poison type. But then it's a fire. So maybe it should be a fire and flying type. It would make sense. But then it's just so weird because it's not supposed to be a poison type. A snake is supposed to be a poison type. Usually it is, but I guess that's not going to be the case for this one. Um, the scenario is changing. New. Old. The new look more like chubbier. The old kind of seem like bland the blur areas and we scroll a bit more up that's one of the birds one of the NPCs well three of the NPCs which has will have voice dialogue um player going through the grass interact and that's how the tenarians will look like Let's go more up, more of the devlog. More devlog. Random weird stuff that they just post. This is more of the talking about like how it would work if one had to versus all of them. So one versus all like five of them. Which is this. If you get it, you get it. Um, I don't know if I could explain that. These are just all catching creature catching games. It's kind of showing. Okay, there's more that devlog. Correct, a yeah, Tenorios. One of them three. They until it comes out like officially, like we could see all of it, and maybe I would choose. Okay, we got this developer settings. Mind you, if you want to pause any moment of this, just for you can see yourself, go ahead. Some of the random tales scenario. That's the trailer. So maybe the game will come out next month. That's what some people's predict. Predictions are. Lots of random other stuff they added. Buildings, players. Box. Actually, there's a lot of things that has changed that I have not even noticed by accident because it just passed by. 
Because I'm just waiting patiently until the game does come out. I do hope the game does come out. It's actually it's pretty, it seems pretty fun. Like a game then I could play this like a Pokemon game. Hopefully I do not fall asleep though. Because usually Pokemon games do that. I just hope they have like a cool beat music that makes me like active. Oh my god guys, Mr. Beast! He's Mr. Beast and Tails scenario. Completely insane guys! Um, more... Platypus. I don't remember. The shinies are a bit weird. I don't know how to explain that. Because they don't... Like, for someone that has is not very big brain on, on, like, stuff like that, they are RNG. On Lumion. I mean, well, Lumions, creature catching Lumions, Tenarians, whatever. We're not very knowledgeable. At least I'm not. That's odd. Am I? Okay, so they're gonna probably make something like the guppies. Cause this wasn't like this. It was a purple one of this. Anyways, let's go to teasers. These might be two legendaries. Critical. Probably for damage. This head down to the research facility together. We will discuss the details. It does have progress. It has progress. I think it's gonna be something, but uh, I'm not gonna say much because even even I don't want to. I just don't want to spoil it. But um, us, there are YouTubers in it, like me. That I we will get some stuff from it, so we will get be able to give away to you guys like stuff that are rare and stuff like that. I don't know how to like explain it without spoiling it because I kind of don't really want to spoil it. And make events, it'll be nice, it'll be fun. And that's his. Then here's the other one, the grass type. And here's the dog. That's the aura. It's just showing you the aura, the how it will, like looks like, kind of the shadow. Here's the attacker, defender, the shark. I guess this is the disc or the capture thing. I think it's probably one of the legendaries. Okay, so this might be an environment. For something very awesome, wink. The fire environment looks pretty nice though. I guess you could say it's pretty lit. Um, wild citrus, stuff like that appeared. Changed a little bit of that. But yeah, I guess that's everything. It's not really much else to talk about. That's kind of, um, that's a little catch up, quick catch, the way for you to catch up with what's been going on Tales of Scenario. Remember, play the game. Um, or else you will have no cookies. Yes, you heard me. No cookies. So you better play it. And I will play with you guys if you want. I'll be there. I'll probably stream it when it's going to come out. Because uh, depending how things are at that time, of course. But hopefully you guys are there to be around when I stream and record stuff for it. Um, game looks pretty decent. Decent, meaning more than better than Lumion Legacy. And uh, mostly a lot of people are hoping for it to be a good catching game. Though. One of the best ones um, to be in Roblox. I'll be playing Fortnite for a while. But the game, uh, while I wait for the game, honestly. But yeah, I'm actually kind of excited for the game. And I don't want to spoil it much, but um, us YouTubers will be able to get something like a title something like that and we will be able to give stuff to our fans to our subscribers and stuff like that and have little they're thinking of giving us like free cam which is seeing the map so yeah and some other stuff lots a little lots of little perks so yeah that's pretty much it that's for you to catch up Pretty much that sums it up of Tales Scenario. I scroll really quick for you guys to understand. If you're missing some parts and don't understand, you could pause it and try to see it yourself. 
or again you could just join the discord server um you could also join my discord server in the description and any other social media i'm gonna stop recording now for you guys because i don't want to extend the video more than it is so i see you guys next time please do stay safe and take care and hopefully you did have a merry christmas Toodaloo. Bye-bye.